Hey guys, it's your boy JDRFT and welcome back to another video. Today we're back and we're going to be talking about the idea of getting a real job. What does that mean? Go get a real job. Like that quote is so stupid in my opinion. Because are you saying certain jobs are not a real job? Because that's kind of disrespectful to people working those certain jobs, right? I'll just say an example, you know, maybe our parents may argue that, oh, working in an office from nine to five, getting paid by the salary and clocking in and out is a good job because you are respected. But then working as a garbage man or waiter or a custodian is not as respected because it's just, it just looks bad on you. You look like a bum. That's kind of rude. That's no, very much rude and very disrespectful because those people, I'd like to argue, are actually working way harder than people who are making a higher wage in certain jobs. Like, how are you to say that that's not a real job? Are they not making a living? Are they not supporting their family? Are they not, you know, putting in work every single day, doing hard labor at times? I just, I don't know. That is just such a... It's just like every job's a real job. If you're working hard, you're helping out the economy, putting money in and putting money out, you know, it's, and you're not on the freaking street dealing drugs and doing drugs, then you're a good citizen. You know, you're a good person. You're like, I, I don't know what else to say, you know? And it's like, another example is like, oh, like if you want to be a musician or an artist, that's not a real job. But how do you know that? How do you how do you know that? I bet the people who are saying that are not like happy with their jobs. Like they're so unhappy and they're pushing that onto other people saying that's not a real job. But artists make a pretty good amount of money if obviously you put in the work in time and then you'll get paid out of commission. You could probably make a lot more money selling stuff online than working a nine to five in the office. You know what I'm saying? You know, or even performers, you know, working on the street or, you know, working in like circuses and stuff like that. They, you know, they show up to events and they probably make a good amount of money, if not the same amount as office people, because they're putting in the time and work. Like you just can't say that because you don't know. You don't know that. But then again, it's like even the whole money thing. Money doesn't even have to be a factor in that. You know, as long as you're working hard and you're supporting yourself or your family, that's a real job. Like, it's a real job. You're working. And, like, it just, it frustrates me, the idea. Because, like, I'll just never get over it. And, then, like, another example that's becoming more dominant now would be becoming a streamer. You know, 10 years ago, or maybe even, like, farther back, that wasn't seen as a real job. But now, after, you know, the whole craze with, like, Fortnite and streaming and Ninja because I'd argue that he was kind of the staple for it. He made it mainstream. He normalized it. And now so many other people are becoming streamers and are making a good amount of money living day to day. Because they worked hard for it. And they are still working hard. They're putting in time, effort, and work just like every other person working a job. Every job is a job. As long as you are not a crackhead, you are doing good in society. That is what I'd like to argue, you know? And it's, it's just, people need to get that through their heads, no matter what. Anything could be a job. And if you, if you keep on having that same mindset, you are going to be stuck being very, very unhappy. You know? Like, who cares if you look bad doing it? Or who cares if, you know, it doesn't look like the typical job? You're living, man. You're living. You're grinding. And you you may be your own boss for a bit of time, you know? You're working for yourself, you know? And it's like, what, what if you say that to someone starting a business? Oh, like, why don't you get a real job? Stop trying to start a business. Like, that is so naive and so, like, inconsiderate to say because, like, you know, maybe one day they'll become really big and, you know, they'll make a lot more money than you do. So, I mean, just a quick video. Just thought about it. Hope you guys enjoy. 
Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.